What is up everybody? I'm back with an all new post tournament match review from 10th level tavern tournament uh, that I attended this past weekend. All in all, it was a fun event, lots of new faces and reconnected with some old faces as well. Um, so yeah, so let's get my redemption arc started. Up first is Chris R. Um, I've never played him before. Um, I caught the last round that he had on stream as I was getting my beer from the bar. Um, from what I saw, he was pretty yellowish for a Julia. Um, he was really twitchy when it came to his defense, so um, I have to expect that he's going to be ducking a lot. So with that, I'm just using the basic Julia knowledge that I've had for God knows how long. And I'll see how I progress and how I break him down. Okay, so we got an infinite. Okay, so here he ended up doing the full string. Um, I tried to move expecting him to like use the first couple of hits to gauge what I would do, but like he just let it rip. Okay, there he dick jabbed after the down back four and I caught his sloppy back dash. Okay, he stopped moving. Oh, there you go. Another sloppy back dash. Go for the Yoki combo. Okay, good block. Wrong punish. Okay, just spacing. And that was autopilot on my part there. Luckily, I caught it because you can see my face. Um, like, I know I told myself to, like, think and not just do. Um, here, I'm just keeping pokes on him, trying to get him to mash. They're adding up. Oh, uh, there I tried to catch his wall standing one, but he didn't do it. Oh, big whiff. Go for the launch. Okay, damage ender. Okay, caught him moving with the, with the butterfly kicks into the quick low for the round. Oh, okay, I, I saw that the back four was going to whiff, but I didn't let the back two one rip. Okay, he's trying, he's interrupting strings for no reason, really. Ooh, another autopilot moment. I should have just reacted and adjusted rather than pressed first. This should kill me? No, okay. Doesn't. Oh, I get cheeky. Yeah, I get cheeky. <laughs> okay, he blocks and just kills me. Good. Okay, caught him with a down for one two on a counter hit. He's holding back. So I'm just going to keep on taking hits. Yeah, okay. I caught him in the defensive moment and he couldn't break the throw. Good duck. Wrong punish. Super surprised he ducked there after all that entire sequence. And yeah, okay. And then I just get cheeky because uh, I know he does not want to duck. <laughs> I just go for three straight lows. No duck again. And he jabbed immediately afterwards. Oh, that was a miss input on my part. I think I want it back to not down back to. All right, so I get up. Mid checks are connecting. Ooh, that was the wrong punish. Okay, he's not ducking. Oh, that was a good call out with the hop kicks. Here he's being he was being mad aggressive. So I knew he was not he was not going to stop there. So I took my juggle, and I know he was not going to tech roll. There you go. Take the reset. And keep pressing forward. Let me get my free damage because he doesn't want to get up. Now we're in a single hit situation. Oh, he's ducking. Oh, and that was the riskiest shoulder ever. Because if he could have blocked it, I would have died. Because he could have just down for 3, 1 plus 2 to me for the round. But either way, it worked out in the end. Um, Yeah, so he's, he's very wild. But he reacts very odd in situations. So I have to like capitalize on that more. Okay, so we got Forgotten Realm. Um, what I'm probably gonna do is I'm gonna try to take as many floor breaks as I can because I don't want to deal with the Julia multi air throw floor break situations. Um, and then just keep it compact as best I can. All right, let's see. So that's a really far sweep. Okay, I punished, cool. 
Oh, Twitch ducking again. That's twice. That's, that's another one. So I'm gonna. Oh, see, I gambled correctly, knowing that he was gonna Twitch duck and the back turn hop kick whiffed. Okay. Taking my free hits because he's not ducking again. Trade. He's mashing. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, so that, so he was going to mash regardless there. Whatever I was going to do. Luckily, it was in my favor. Okay, same situation as the previous round. Oh, that was a good mash. Um, what I should have done is just instantly gone for the Kincho 1 plus 2. But I was hoping some hesitation to make him duck. Oh, what is he doing? Okay, that's like some online stuff. Yeah, he's being mad aggressive. So I'm gonna, yeah. So I, so he was pressing way too much. So I was gonna take, take the free string there. So floor break. Let me regen some health. Man, that was a misinput. I know 100% that was a misinput. <laughs> like I was probably going for the rage drive, and somehow I got quarter circle back because I was rolling my stick too much. Okay, wrong punish again. That was a misinput. Not sure how I got the. Whole the walk instead of the flea two. Okay, he's running in again. No duck again on the back to two, so that's pretty free against him. Might as well be plus frames there. Okay, so there, no hesitation after the four four three, and I catch him. Get cheeky. He doesn't punish correctly, so I'm just taking all my frames here. Oh, miss input there. <laughs> that was probably like a two down three. Alright, so I still get the round, but I'm pretty sure that was a miss input. I probably did a two down three way too quickly, and it registered as a two three. Uh, I should have ended the down back three three string. I would have been safe there. Oh well, okay. Um, there. I think here's when I try to position change. Yeah, I try to position change, and the cross up didn't happen, and he went for like an immediate full crouch. So. Down forward, three, four. Okay, what's he doing? Is he instantly hop kicks every time I go into flea? That's the wrong punish. Oh, that was a miss input too. I think I wanted three plus four there. Not three. Okay. Oh, I see. And that throw attempt, I'm 100% sure he just was going for the throw regardless and it just lined up to get the back throw. Oh, there I missed the evasion cancel and I got hit. Okay, that's safe. He's mashing after safe moves. He's mashing after getting hit. All right, there I was going to go for a sword sweep either way, regardless if he did a jab or not, but he did a even slower high. So, okay, NSS, same thing. Okay, throw break. Yeah, so he, he was going to mash regardless after the throw break. Um, just because like he was mashing after every interaction, so it was bound to happen once again. And that throw, he's she's pretty negative. So unless he did something crazy like a quarter circle forward two, I would have been okay. Like overall, it was a wild match, but I still uh, weathered the storm and advanced. Up next is non-entity, and I think this time he does not use Nina versus me like he did in the previous tournament. He goes straight to Safina, and actually performs pretty well from what I remember. Not 100% sure, but I remember he was doing better than what he normally does. All right, so let's see. Okay, Katri moving. That's moving cleanly. He's jabbing after down forward one instantly. Oh, wrong punish on my part. Oh, wrong punish again. Man, what is going on? Okay. 
Oh, no punish on my part. That's unfortunate. Okay, I chase with the 4 4 3. He's just doing basic Safina stuff, no lows, unless I'm really far away. Yeah, see, no lows. Okay, he got caught with the mid. Okay, there we go. Flip over, stab, and that's the round. Okay. Overall, he's not doing much, really. Let's see if he kind of goes a little crazier. Okay, down forward, one, two. I interrupt with my own. Okay, that's a good homing on his side. I had, to, I had to check the down back four. I don't know what that four was about, but... Okay, he's not ducking the down forward one, two. He's not ducking at all, really. He's just blocking. Oh, that was a good four, four, four. And I messed up there, and I got hit by the down two. I should have just got up straight instead of tried to move. That was a misinput. I wanted the sword sweep there. All right. He does not get the wall. He tries to splat. Oh, I missed the duck, and I got hit. Okay, I want to take my frames. Keep on taking the frames, because he's not ducking. <laughs> and that, and the old switcheroo with the shark attack. Okay, he's not attacking correctly. He's panic blocking. Okay. I think here's my mess up. Yeah. I remember this. Like, I remember I tapped back four too late, and I still got hit. Because the evasion spin avoids that mix up. Okay, there he's pushing after the down forward 1 4. Oh, he pushed into the 1 2 1. Okay, I'm taking the Oki. He mashed after the initial poison wind. Yeah, he, like, he was antsy. Like, he wanted to press. Not sure why. There was nothing on the line, really. It was just want to be aggressive. Ooh, there I got caught pressing. Okay, he doesn't go for the good ender at the wall. Okay, I go for the low parry. Go for the chunky damage. Okay. Yep. Oh, I should have gone into flee instead. Oh, I tried to catch his backflip. Do I hit low? Yep. Okay. Take the frames. Keep on annoying. Then I wanted to see if he was going to do a down three, but he didn't. Uh, okay, good. There, I should have waited and did that a single back four. But I was late on it and got hit. And there, he whiffed. And yeah, and then during the scramble, he always presses. And that's when I called him out on it. It was just a scramble on both sides. But when I, when I did the hop kick and it, and it was blocked, I knew he was going to panic something. It could have been the hell sweep at a scarecrow or whatever. But he was going to press in scarecrow. And I called it out and was the correct read. In this round, I was going to try to make him duck. Oh, oh, there it is. Okay. Um, take my free grounded hit because he held back. That was me autopiloting. Okay. There's him autopiloting. I convert. Do I spike? And yeah, relaunch. Oh, there I did the Kincho 4 too early. Uh, and there he was just hesitating, expecting the low. And I went for the throw. All right, that was a kind of scrambly. Okay, he caught me with a 4042 again. Oh, there I ducked way too late. That's my fault, though. Oh, that was a miss input on my side. Oh, there once again, he mashed in Scarecrow. Okay, Oki hits. There you go, see? He entered Scarecrow once again, and he mashed. And I take the Rage Flash. And uh, now let's check. He just didn't duck. So it was in my favor there. Okay, so now. Oh, uh, wrong punish, but it's better than nothing. All right. Ooh, miss input. That sucked. Okay. Once again, see, he mashed again when he went into Scarecrow. He doesn't like hesitating in Scarecrow. Uh, okay, so she gets to juggle. Goes for Oki. I'm not ducking. Okay, take my free hit. He tried to move after the down back four. Okay, she went into Tarantula. Instantly go for cross dash one. Okay, and then here he goes mid because he already wasted his low option. And okay, there we go. Clean conversion there for the round.
All in all, it was a pretty straightforward set. Nothing crazy happening there. Um, and then I believe my next match is against Rauschka, but I'll put that onto the next video. So yeah, guys, um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you're not. Um, yeah, so if this helped you out, just let me know. Leave a comment below. And yeah, guys, I'll catch you in the next one. Peace. Stockholm. Yeah, she just called those matches. What was your score?